Hello, this is Asher, and I'd like to show you my new Death Star mock. So, right here is room one, and in it is the laser, and it's pretty small. This is one of my smallest mocks that I just wanted to do for fun. I thought it'd be fun. And then right here is the control panel to control the laser. I don't know if you can see it, but I'm going to try to see. Yep, so there's the control panel. The next room over is Palpatine's throne room. And on the throne we have Palpatine and his royal guard. He's shooting off some lightning for no reason. Then you turn it around like this. And then here's the meeting room where you have Darth Vader. And he's in a meeting with the other people. I didn't have any real imperial meeting people so i just use these lego guys who look imperialish so the next room over is the control or nav and then right here is the navigation system that's meant to be alderaan with the sun slowly rising you can barely see the orange work then right here you have a stormtrooper who's guarding it all then how the Death Star works is the in order to get to the floors on the bottom, you pick it up like this and you flip it over. And now here's the bottom floors, or they could be the top, depending on which way you do it. Because I think, because I personally think that the Death Star looks cooler like this. And then, I know on camera it doesn't look much like a ball, but when you're up close with it, it looks a whole lot more like a ball. So anyways, here's the trash compactor with... Luke and Han in it, and then I'm going to take these guys out so I can show how the trash compactor can go fully. So it goes like this, and it completely compacts what's ever in there. And you can open it up. Then, next room over is cell block D, I think. And then, right here's the controls where Han uh, pretended that he was a stormtrooper and faked his ID. And right here's a stormtrooper guard who's guarding the pathway to Leia's cell. And there wasn't enough room to make a door, so it was just like this. And then I somehow lost her hair at a friend's house, so she's just sitting there. And then if you look closely, you can see the vent that goes into the trash compactor room. Okay, then the next room over, whoops, something just snapped. Uh, okay, so this room is the launch bay, and then right there is the elevator that the troopers took. Then those are some troopers. Then right here is the... It's meant to be, like, the room that oversees the whole place that you see from the movie A New Hope, where they're up here and they're asking Luke down here what's going on with his helmet. Then, next room... Whoops, the laser turret fell off. So I'll have to fix that later. But the next room is the gap room. And here's Obi-Wan trying to take down the shield. I'm going to take him out so you can see the shield better. So then here's the shield room. And then he's meant to flick down this switch. And then the lights go off. And then he's completed his mission. Then right over there are some custom stickers I put in to do, like, the background lights. And then the Death Star isn't complete yet because on the outside, uh, or I'm not complete showing it, because on the outside are all these turrets that I've done. That And there's actually a video on how to make them. Then right there's the exhaust port. Then here, it's kind of hard to see because it's so small. There's a mini model of Luke's... Uh, his X-Wing, and it goes on a stand right here. Then right here is a TIE Fighter that's in pursuit. But I used to have a, Le a mini Lego Millennium Falcon that I built that went right there. But, yeah, to save Luke at the last second, but it fell off, so and I can't find it. So, yeah, that's the whole Death Star. Uh, please like and subscribe. And also, I'm working on... Uh, uh, a Lego Star Killer base. So I'm just going to give you a quick preview of what that's going to look like for my next video.